Joe, you're with Evan from the West Ham Way and I'm joined by a special guest, Mark Phillips, who is the assistant manager of the under-18s team. Mark, this season, the under-18s are flying. Uh, that's all down to you and the team. Can you explain about that to us, please? It's down to the team, not down to me. <laughs> it's always down to the players. No, we've done, we've done well. We've had, we've had some good runs and we've got ourselves in the top four, which is quite important. I don't know how you know the leagues work. If you get in the top four, then you play the top four, the normal section. You know, the likes of Man City, Everton, Liverpool teams like that. So it's important to get there and test yourself. I mean, we've got so many under 18s playing in the under 21s, which is fantastic. Yeah, that's what it's all about. It's about developing players and getting them further on than you in the first team. That's, that's exactly it. And um, you talk about these players that are playing yeah, for the yeah. under 21s. Is it is it sort of surreal for you to see how well they're sort of developing this year? Yeah, no, it is. I mean, you, you, I was involved in the 21s game in Newcastle. I, 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 I hope so, it's every one it. But it's great to see the under 18s and even even more so see 21s players on the bench for the first time. I mean, if you think about Ben to Liverpool away, it was all young. I mean, and the players that have gone out and loaned Josh Cullen, Reese Burke, Mike Samuelson, Lewis Page. All doing well on loan, so the club's really got a good feel about bottom to top at the moment. Really. Well, exactly. I mean, I, I think it's been a long, a long few years since we've had players of this sort of calibre coming through from this age. Um, you mentioned Martin Samuelson. Then everyone's around, surrounded him on Twitter. What, what are your thoughts on him as a player? Uh, excellent technical player. He's fantastic one v one, and he's proved it in in Division One. He's also proved it against Premier League opposition when he played West Brom in the cup. So. It's getting him to do it on a consistent basis, you know, week in, week out in the Premier League. And a lot of it is, I hate to mention the name Tottenham, they did give their players the opportunity. But they're giving the opportunity, the young players yeah, seem to be coming up to the mark. They are thriving, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, and I think we've got the players at West Ham United who have been there and do the same thing. They're giving the opportunity. Well, exactly. And you and Steve are obviously, obviously doing a great job. What's it like to work with Steve, West Ham legend? Here? Well, I mean, I'm a West Ham fan, so it's like, I mean, it's not like I'm working with Steve. I mean, I've worked with him now solidly for four years. He's up Probably be close as town now as well, sort of thing. So it's, all my mates can't believe that. Oh. <laughs> we work with Steve Potts, so he's a bit, he's a bit unreal. To be honest, isn't he? Oh, that's fantastic. I mean, I, I would be overwhelmed, you know, going to work every day and being with them. But final thought yeah. today. I, 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 I don't want to bum him up too much in case he's watching this. Oh, of course. <laughs> I'm joking, You're Steve. listening, Steve. <laughs> no one likes it. <laughs> so today we're playing Crystal Palace. What are your thoughts? What do you think we can do today? Games are worrying me. Games we're okay. always expected to win. This is one of those games. I think we'll win the game. I think Palace will score. Got a prediction? Uh, two or three one. Oh, that's three it. one's that's fine. It. So that's, that's sitting on the fence. I go three one. Hey, uh, there we go. We're a team. We're a team. So Mark, it's been a pleasure talking to you. Top man. Take Top care man. for the rest of the season. Alright. I'm going to have a beer now. Have as many beers as you want, mate. <laughs> Top man.